In this video, we'll create a sample application and configure probing with it to make it self-healing. Before configuring probes for our application, we first need to create and configure the sample application, which is called Book Info. To create and configure the Book Info application, see our video on how to build your first application with Cloudplex. Now that you've created the sample application, let's configure probing. Kubernetes liveness and readiness probes can be used to make a service more robust and more resilient by reducing operational issues and improving the quality of the service. Kubernetes uses readiness probes to decide when the container is available for accepting traffic. A pod is considered ready when all of its containers are ready. Kubernetes uses liveness probes to know when to restart a container. If a container is unresponsive due to some issue, restarting the container can make the application more available. To configure readiness and liveness probes, click on the product page container and click on advanced configurations and then select probing. Let's configure the readiness probe first. Select HTTP GET from the handler dropdown and provide the path of slash health. Type 9080 in the port field. Type product page in the host field. Type 5 in the initial delay seconds field. Type 2 in the timeout seconds field. Type 10 in the period seconds field. And type 1 in the success threshold field and 1 in the failure threshold field. All field descriptions are available on the platform once you hover over the field. Let's configure the liveness probe next. Select HTTP GET from the handler dropdown and enter the path of slash health again. Type 9080 in the port field. Type product page in the host field again. Type 20 in the initial delay seconds field. Type 5 in the timeout seconds field. Type 30 in the period seconds field. And type 1 in the success threshold field and 3 in the failure threshold field. Click on the save button to save the service. Click on the Deploy button to select infrastructures on which you want to deploy your application. You will see the logs as the application deployment progresses. You can see the status of the application you just deployed by clicking on the Status tab where you can see the table view of the real-time status of your services. You can see the application you just deployed by copying the Ingress IP address from the Status tab. Open a new browser tab and paste the Ingress IP address. You will see your application deployed on the Kubernetes cluster you created with Kubeplex. To avoid unnecessary costs, don't forget to terminate your application when you are done. Click on the Terminate button to delete all your resources from your infrastructure. Don't forget to terminate your infrastructure when you are done with it as well. You just deployed the sample application with liveness and readiness probes to make a self-healing application using Cloudplex, the Kubernetes application platform for developers.